Hello everyone, welcome back to Online Classroom Jake Gutio. In this video, we are going to enter into chapter 13, Meteoroid, Asteroid, and Comet. In this video, we are going to look at these three objects, what are they, and we are also going to discuss a little bit of their respective characteristics. So first, what is a meteoroid? Meteoroid is actually a floating piece of stone and metal that moves about in space. They move very freely and they do not have their own orbit. So they move as they wish. Okay, they are floating around freely. So meteoroids actually appear in various sizes but they are relatively very small. Compared to asteroid and comet, they are only about from 10 micrometer to 1 meter. To put that into perspective, if you have a ruler near you, 10 micrometer is smaller than 1 centimeter. It is very small. Okay, the biggest may be around 1 meter, which is 100 centimeter. Okay, it, made up, it is made up of stones and metals such as iron and nickel. I get a lot of questions that ask me, what is iron and what is nickel? They are different types of metals. Okay, they are under the categories of uh, metals. Why are meteoroids so small? Because actually, meteoroid comes from asteroids and comets. It's the fragments from asteroids and comets. We can say that they are actually a debris. Okay, and its surface temperature in the outer space is about 0 degrees Celsius and they travel at different speed. The, faster, the fastest one uh, maybe can travel at about 42 km per second. What that means is in just one second like that, one second, they can travel as far as 42 km. That is pretty impressive, isn't it? How about asteroid? Asteroid is a large metal and rocky body that travels around the sun in its own orbit. They are just like meteoroid but they are a lot bigger and they don't travel or float around freely. They have their own orbit. Okay, but they are a lot bigger. Well that makes sense, doesn't it? Because meteoroid comes from Asteroid. Remember, meteoroid are just a fragment that comes from asteroid. So, some characteristics of an asteroid: their size starts from about one meter to a thousand kilometer. So that's a lot bigger compared to a meteoroid. They are made up of stones and metals such as iron and nickel. Well, that is not a surprise because just like meteoroid, right? Meteoroid comes from asteroid. You heard me repeat that many times. Okay, hopefully you can remember that. And it has a cold surface temperature that is about negative 73 degrees Celsius. And it travels around the sun at the average speed of 25 km per second. So a little bit slower compared to meteorite, but still very impressive. In a second, they can travel up to 25 km. And I love this term, asteroid belt. What is asteroid belt? It is actually the space in between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter. Look at this diagram here. Mars is the reddish uh, planet after our Earth and Jupiter is the biggest planet. So in between Mars and Jupiter, you find a belt of asteroid here. There are a lot of asteroids that are found in this space. That's why we call it the asteroid belt. Well, there are some very big asteroids that can have the diameters of a few kilometers to even a thousand kilometers. Some of these large asteroids are uh, Ceres, Pallas, Juna, and Vesta. We give them names, yeah? And asteroids, we give them another a name they are also known as small planets they behave just like planets don't they they have their own orbit they orbit around the sun but they're a lot smaller so we call them small planets 
Next, let's look at Comet. Among the three, I really love Comet because it is so beautiful. A comet is actually a very small body that is made up of a mixture of ice, gas, and frozen dust. Well, it is not that small actually. The small body is a little bit misleading, but it is made up of the mixture of ice, gas, and frozen dust. Basically, it's a frozen ball. Okay. It also has its own orbit and travels around the sun, just like the asteroid. But the content of it is very different. Okay. It is not a, a a rock or metal like asteroid, but ice, gas, and frozen dust. And from the picture, you can see that comet has two main parts. It has a head and a tail. And it can be very long. The tail can reach up to 150 million kilometers. That is very, very, very long. And the size of the head can reach up to 250,000 kilometers. So they are huge. It comprises of gas and water that freeze into ice, dust, and rocky particles. It travels around the sun in its own orbit and the shape of the uh, orbit of comet is elliptical. It travels at the average speed of, uh, the average speed of from about 10 km per second to 70 km per second. So the speed varies. Well, that's all from Jekutio in this video. I shall see you in the next video when we will look at the movement of meteoroid, asteroid, and comet. Yeah? Bye! If you have learned something new from this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.